So for Colch Compass, I'm here with Matthew and Reese of the Blackout. How are you? Good, thank you. You? Good. Not too bad. Yeah, very good. Are you feeling refreshed after your performance? Have you got some bevies yes. in and uh, washed? Yeah, we've. My voice has gone a bit. We, we did a, we did a sign in just now, so it's like trying to shout the feel. Yeah, but all good though. Show yeah. was good. It was good. Enjoyed it. Yeah, it was good. But yeah, we were gremlins with microphones at the start, but it's, it's, it always happens on the main stage. You have to expect it, don't yeah, yeah. you? Yeah. If it didn't happen. Like something, something, else, something severe right. might happen to you later in the night. Be like, oh no. <laughs> Were those big black bulls down to you guys? No. Yeah, yeah. No. yeah, get your story straight if you're going to lie. Yeah, yeah, we were going to get those Zorbin things yeah. and get Gavin and Sean inside them, but they, well, Gavin wanted to do it, but I don't think Sean wanted to. Gutless yeah. wonder, isn't he? Sean's just miserable. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Some band done that yesterday, though. some photos last oh, night. Yeah, so. yeah. yeah we, we've really done good. most things, like we've done those. We've done those cli- we, we, Some of you have. Done that we've done those cliched things that you do in festivals, that, like the sit down thing and the jump up. And we've done we've done the stormtroopers, which everyone does. Yeah. <laughs> and did you have something quite phallic at one of your things once as well? My middle fingers. Yes. Oh, we why, had... I thought you had a penis. Did you not have a penis? <laughs> I have. I have one. I have you, had, yeah, 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 accurate. Not, not a, yeah, yeah. We had. We did download a few years ago, and we had a backdrop which we have now, which is F the blackout. Um, and then we had two inflatable middle fingers either side of the stage, which were about 20 foot. Pretty big. Yeah, because it was like a kind of rock festival, so we weren't sure how we, we'd go down. So we were kind of like, mm. but we went down well. We're like, Excellent. Yeah, so that could be next time. Yep. I've given you an idea. Yeah, so, yeah. so I should essentially get some of the money, yeah, yeah, if it goes well. Might not have been on the BBC if we did it, but. So you were live on the BBC, weren't you? Yeah, it was. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think BBC Three, thing it was. Yeah. Because yeah, my girlfriend watched it, so yeah. I think you've been on the main stage 2011 and 2008, was it? Uh, yeah, it's a third yes. time. Yeah. How do you ensure that you kind of get better each time? Is it stuff like the penises for next time and the stuff way we're like going, that? We're going up a slot every two years. So yeah. I think in about 10 years, we should be headlining. Yeah, you will. I like your optimism. I think so, yeah. yeah we'll, keep, we'll keep the penis keep idea for the headlines. Yeah. Yeah. Biff, Biffy won't have a penis, will he? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, M&M, M&M Giant balls. Yeah. <laughs> Sweaty M&M balls. Probably the penis. Because Limp Bizkit at the toilet before and that looked awesome. It was like a huge toilet. Fred Dirce was stood on top of it. That's pretty exciting, isn't it? It is. Yeah. Ramstein have done penises. Yes. They've Ramstein. done everything. They've done, they yeah. Done. They, they, are, they, are, they are pyrotechnicians as well, so yes. they, they kind of they can do stuff. Yeah. Let's, talk, let's talk about you some more rather than Ramstein and their rude things. You've got a podcast thing now, I believe. Well. Kind of. Yeah, we just we, we're trying to keep busy and do things like get some content online because we we write in at the moment and we kind of we tour in October and November, so we're just gonna keep busy until then so we can just get stuff online. It was like a deliberate thing, like we used to have Gavin, it's like doing something. I didn't really know what he was we were doing, and his laptop was just recording, and then Gavin realised and he was like, oh, we, we could use this, and that's how it sort of come about. And so that's we, all, yeah. we always talk a lot of rubbish, so it's quite. It's, it might, it might, it might be entertaining to other people, but I don't know about us. But to me, it's like stop talking. But I guess other people find it funny. We've been like together for ten years now, so everyone's just like, just shut up, Reese. Ten years of this, come on, Reese, shut up. Constantly talking rubbish. What do you think you all bring to the group then? What is your unique attribute, each of you, um, that you've learned after tennis guitar? Oh. <laughs> You're the smart Alec then, that's all you. Uh, uh, well, Sean is just loud, I mean, and cocky. Yeah. Uh, Bobby's. Angry. Angry, uh, yeah. Bob just brings fury wherever he goes. <laughs> Snores is pleasant. He's kind, isn't he? Big kind giant. Yeah. <laughs> Gavin. Uh, yeah, they're, they're, they're all nice. Blue eyes. <laughs> yeah, blue eyes. Yeah. Um, just blue eyes yeah. That's what they come for. Reese brings uh, weirdness mostly. Yeah, a lot of rubbish. Nonsense. Can you bring something weird to Colch Compass today? Sorry, what? Can you bring something weird to Colch Compass? Or like do something. Do so. I'm going to put you on the this spot. Is, this is awkward, no. Oh, lower than Atlantis are kind of encroaching on the interview there. Unbelievable. Little scaravouches. What are we going to do then? That kind of saved by the lower than Atlantis there, weren't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. You, you missed it then because he was in the way. But I did something really cool then. I did like ten backflips in a second. <laughs> what do I bring? Sorry. What do I bring, Reese? You bring uh, conversation. 
and, and guitar riffs and and changing the subject of what we just that, that trick I was meant to do and uh, yeah Essen essential things and now the tour that's with Blitz Kids and Framing Hanley uh, is it? not Blitz Kids uh, well I read something on, oh go on give what? me an exclusive what? go on what you read? can I have an exclusive I read Blitz Kids and Framing Hanley because you know I like to do my yeah, research that's supposed to be the case yeah. the Blitz Kids pulled out is it a bunch of arseholes what was their reason? Was it valid? Because uh, uh, Matthew can take this. Uh, yeah. That's <laughs> the reason. They're a bunch of assholes. No, they're not really. They just pull out. So they want to do a different tour, basically. So who's replacing them? Do we know yet? We do not know. Well, yeah, we're in talks. They're pretty, they're pretty good. In talks with who? Yeah. Yeah. Um, we asked. He is legend. Yeah, sure, awesome. But we don't know anything to do it. Uh, we still want to find out. Yeah, we're in, we're in talks with them. We, got, we got, don't have that much time because it's kind of a bit we didn't expect these things to happen as you, as you do when you plan a tour, but they have, so we'll, re we'll recoup. You will. Yeah, yeah. You fought back from harder things before, yeah. haven't you? Yeah. Resilient chaps. Yeah. yeah. Can you give me a bit of an exclusive about what the new songs might be like if you're writing now? Uh, heavier, uh, more energy, I guess. Because uh, we did, when you start a band, you kind of like just write songs that kind of be just heavy. And then you kind of like, you kind of like, oh, I can write a song. So you write kind of like poppier songs, kind of like pleasant songs. But then I guess we've, we've kind of done that now. So we're just going to write some heavier songs again just to have a laugh with. So they, they kind of... It's fun to play live, yeah, I guess. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. They, they go down well live, so... Well, we were like... When we first started writing, we couldn't really write. So we used to just jam bits of, bits of songs, like try and make a heavy on purpose. And then like, I don't know, like... I kind of want to fancy doing that again. And like, it's just yeah. fun in a way. And, like, it's, it's not like we're angry to write these songs but it's always kind of like it's cool just to have a you know just a bit of a like yeah we've all got it in us haven't we yeah. we need just to let it out yeah. Yeah. yeah on that note I'll let you go and put some oomph into the party now yeah sorry about I said the word oomph sorry about that <laughs> wrong with that Sudino, so I go use these crap words I'm on my way as well oh, yeah. oh. sad times let's not go into that um, have a good rest of 2013 thank you very much thank you thank you